Hey guys, welcome back to another video from Kai to NID. And today we will talk about how to improve your visual reasoning. So a lot of people who are not from arts or design background have this question, especially people from engineering or commerce background wonder like what the hell is visual reasoning like how should we solve those problems which are so different from basic numericals and the logic is completely different from what they have studied so far so i'll give you some basic exercises uh, through which you can easily improve on your visual reasoning skills and these practices are a lot of fun and very easy to do so all you need to take is uh, these uh, simple plain a4 sheets and uh, some cutting tools like this uh, pen knife okay a lot of these things are available in basic stationery stores and you'll get this for around two three hundred rupees it's a good long-term investment and uh, if you don't have this kind of tool then uh, even this kind of cutter is fine or a simple scissor will also do so all you need to do is basically just take these papers fold it into different shapes and now what you need to do is just use your scissor and try to make different types of cuts here I'll make this one cut. Okay. See. I'll make this one cut here. Okay. And here is a joint. I'll make this round cut here. Slightly round. Okay. This is a little tricky part. You have to go slowly and move the paper along. So here is a kind of round cut okay also on these sides so the whole point of making these cuts is to basically understand on which surface which cut goes where and how the whole thing comes up so now you see this triangle this v section has actually become a rectangle kind of shape that arc has actually become a circle this is how the pattern has emerged right so if you do these kind of exercises, these things actually doesn't take much time, but it will improve a lot of your visual understanding of how shapes form, how the whole thing works in different planes and how symmetry plays its role in the formation of new shapes. so guys these are the basic exercises the more you put different elements into it slowly it will become more and more complex the more complex it becomes the more interesting it becomes for you to solve it at the later stages you have to predict what kind of cut will create what kind of shape after opening the fold so that is the whole exercise all about after 15-20 iterations 
you will be able to understand the geometry of folding and how certain folds results in different kinds of shape and this is what is the basic of visual reasoning in the future i will give you more exercises and this is just the beginning of it and i hope you will find it very easy and interesting if you like these videos please comment share and subscribe if you have any doubts please ask in the comment section below and i'll try my best to answer all your queries i hope you enjoy it see you in the next video till then bye bye take care